usually worst in the morning, especially if I've slept on my arm. If I sleep on my back or you know, with my arms out, I'm usually okay. So your arm only hurts after you lie on top of it all night? Yeah. Hmm. Well, have you thought about, I don't know, not doing that? Yeah, but it's how I sleep. It's how I've always slept. Well, it's always surgery. To do what? Like clean off some cartilage or something? You're not sleeping on some cartilage. You're sleeping on your arm. You want to remove my arm? Well, it is your left. That guy's got to sleep. Are you insane? Joining my father for lunch. I should have called ahead for a table. Dr. House was just enjoying a Reuben. It's OK. I, after 10 years, anything that'll get doctors in the same room is. What are you doing? Nothing. What are you doing? Chips. I want to see something really cool. I saw you leaving last Tuesday. Practically tripped over two guys on your way out, but you had no problem opening doors. It's called a kinetopsia. You can't see things when they move. And since you haven't been hit by a bus, I assume that it's intermittent. It's probably accompanied by seizures, which made me think that I could set one off by flashing them. God, I love this family. I have to do this myself. I got a bum leg. Say ah. Uh, ah. Uh, ah. Uh. Feels rough. Yes, it's a rash. I'm gonna need more than rough. Well, it, it's just rough. Can't you feel it? Well, I could, but then what satisfaction would you get? Got it. Start counting. How many? 26. Okay, either you suck at math or you're gonna die in two seconds. You suck at math. How old are you? 30. And you've never seen an after school special? Dawson's Creek? How do you get to 30 and not know about condoms? Oh, God, I have an STD. No, but you will. Every patient who comes in here for an STD test has one thing in common. They had a SWS, sex while stupid. How old are you? 60. You're lying. That's not the point. Have you never seen Dawson's Creek? And you've never seen an after school special. How do you live to your age and not know about condoms? throat hurts. That phrasing means you think it doesn't. No, I don't. Good enough for me. Where are you going? Mother is no best. Get yourself a sucker on the way out. Look, I think he's just faking so he doesn't have to go to school. How did you know I was a truant officer? I told him he had a choice, go to school or the doctor. Right. He's wasting your precious time, so you decided to waste mine. How thoughtful. I'm in a wheelchair, so I can't examine him all the way up there. Hop down. My life is just one horror after another. Open. Does it look like it hurts? Nope. What's that? S syringe. I'm with you. You make him hate the doctor's office more than he hates school. That's OK. I, I, don't, I don't think that. It's just saline. Hurts like hell when it's injected directly into the muscle. So what do you think, arm or ass? I think he's learned his lesson. Oh, I don't know. You better check. Jack, is your mommy a big, fat idiot? Oh, well, what do you know? I guess you were right. There was construction on Radcliffe, so I had to get out of the car and, and walk in high heels for over a mile. Radcliffe? What was the cross street? Does it matter? I don't know. I'm not the one who brought it up. Tie this off. Nice and tight. Does this have anything to do with my foot? 
You have a blister. You don't waste a doctor's time with a blister. You waste a doctor's time with more important things, like the sewer that's being vented out of your mouth. My breath? If you could stop doing that, we'd all be grateful. I can't stop breathing. Nope, but you can stop puking. I don't. Your lips say no. Your gnarly fingers say. He's good to go. It's a shame. You do look cute that thin. Are, are those the urine test results? Yes. And I'm going to ask you for some blood. Why? To see if your answer will be, I can't bleed in public. This wasn't your urine, was it? Why would I give you someone else's urine? The usual reason is because you're on steroids. I'm not an athlete. Duh. Second favorite reason is because you're on drugs. I'm not. I am. Third favorite reason is you have insurance, but your friend Eggs Benedict doesn't. So Eggs describes a list of symptoms, and you repeat them to a doctor, which is particularly stupid because this is a free clinic. Need you now. My work here is done. Am I OK? Is it diabetes? No, you're pregnant. It's about my bowel movement. What is it these days? I'm sure you want to be here for this. We do everything together. Of course. Toilet can be a lonely place. Drop your pants, I'll suit up. They float. Huh? My bowel movements. Honey says they're not supposed to. I'm a nutritionist. Yes, I can tell from the cool toe loop sandals. Thank you. You're welcome. And the natural fiber clothing, I assume, means some kind of vegetarian denomination? We're vegans. At first, I was a little concerned about the lack of protein, but honey showed me you can get it from once. Well, whatever floats your poop. And you've been together how long? Six months? How'd you know? So after six months, poop love fades. If you've been together shorter than that, then I'll explain right after this break.